When it comes to gift giving, what do you give a gardener? Today, I have six gifts for gardeners they will love. This is not a sponsored video, so I didn't get any of these gifts for free. I personally purchased each one of these, and what I found is each one of these I would love to receive as a gift. So I hope that my six selections will help you out when it comes to finding a gift for a gardener in your life. Let's get started. First up is Peppermint Foot Spray. This is by The Body Shop and it is made in England. It is only $10 on Amazon. It's a great stocking stuffer, although for me, if I just got this as a gift, I'd be thrilled. I use this all the time when I'm gardening or I've been on my feet all day. It's peppermint, but the scent doesn't linger. So it's more of a quick treat. I use it after I'm done gardening for the day and then my feet are so tired, I spray these on. I just kind of enjoy the spa-like scent and uh, that's it. So easy gift on Amazon, 10 bucks, peppermint foot spray, body shop, excellent product. As you can see, my bottle is down to here. <laughs> I obviously use this. Next up is the Q Guide to Growing Bulbs. This is from the Royal Botanic Garden. It is a great little book to have. It's a hardcover. It has a combination of vintage illustrations, which I love, as well as photographs to show you exactly how the bulbs are gonna look like in your gardens. It covers 66 of the most common bulbs, which is a lot. They have different projects like how to build a lasagna bulb garden where you layer bulbs, how to plant bulbs in shady spots in your garden. So all kinds of unique stuff. It's an adorable book. This is only $8.49, which is amazing for a beautiful gift book like this. But it's also a book that I referred to, even though I've been growing bulbs for a few years, I learned a bunch of things I made notes for next year when I'm growing bulbs. If you have a gardener that isn't really into growing bulbs, but maybe more house plants, this book is one in a series of six books. They are growing fruit, growing vegetables, growing herbs, growing orchids, growing houseplants, and then of course growing bulbs. The price range for all of these books is between $8.49 and $16, so you are sure to find something that you're really gonna like. Next up is a garden tool. Now, I know what you're thinking because I would think this too, is if somebody got me a garden tool, and that has happened, I'm kinda like, well, I already have the tools I use, um, if I don't have them, it's maybe because I don't need them. But this is a little different. I decided to put an heirloom garden tool on the list because these are tools that are guaranteed for a lifetime and truly do become heirlooms. Uh, some people end up passing these down to their kids. So these are made by DeWitt. It is a company in Holland. They are made in Holland. They're guaranteed for a lifetime. So anything happens to this, you contact the company and get a replacement. But you won't need a replacement. These things are so durable made of boron steel, wood handle, very lightweight and feels good in the hand. Uh, what I got was called a snake tongue trowel. That's what this is. But they have a whole bunch of different tools in the series and all of them I found on Amazon. The prices kind of vary a little bit, but I'll put a link in the description box below so you can take a look at all those tools. The price for this was $34, maybe more money than the average gardener would want to spend on a tool for themselves. I wouldn't normally, but now that I have this, I love it. I used it a little bit and then I cleaned it off because I didn't want it to be all filthy for filming this. But what it can do is three things. It can help you pop weeds because of the sharp blade right here. It can help you dig plants and also it can help you plant bulbs and that's what I'm using it for this fall and I love it. I guarantee you this would be something special to give a gardener. So next up is A Way to Garden. It's a book by Margaret Roach. Margaret was the first garden editor of Martha Stewart Living Magazine, if you remember that magazine. I used to love that magazine. Uh, since then, she has a blog of the same name called A Way to Garden. Now, she originally wrote this book 21 years ago, but it was re-released and updated last year. It's a beautiful hardcover book. Uh, the images are beautiful throughout. She has so much garden wisdom, but she also tells it with humor and realism. It's a fabulous gift for newer gardeners, but even seasoned gardeners will enjoy reading this. I sure did. One review that I wanted to read to you called it a gorgeous, helpful, and tenderly funny book for anyone who likes putting plants in the ground. I love the fact that it's a way to garden and not the way to garden. 
The current price on Amazon as of this filming is $21.99. It is a fabulous book. Honestly, it's a great gift idea. So next up on my gift ideas for gardeners that they will love is this set of three candles from Finding Home Farms. It's a cute little set I found on QVC. You get three of them. Each one burns 30 to 35 hours, so that is actually kind of pretty much rivals some of the larger jar candles out there, but it's the scents that will blow you away. The fragrances are beautiful. Sage Evergreen is one, Lavender Evergreen is another, and Mint Evergreen is the other one. These are beautiful. I just have to smell one because they're so great. What's nice about it is it's a soft, natural fragrance. And if you're like me, as a gardener, you want something soft and not perfumey. If you're looking for those giant jar candles that scent up your whole house and your driveway, um, that's not what these are. The scents are very soft. And in fact, what's nice about these is because it's evergreen is the base scent and one is sage, one is lavender, and one is mint, you can burn all three of them together, which I've done, and it's beautiful. I buy these regularly. I mean, this is, these are beautiful. I, I just, I can't even pick a favorite, but because they mix evergreen with another scent is what makes it special. This set is $29.50, which can seem like a lot, but what's also cool about this is it's an American-made product. Finding Home Farms is in upstate New York. Everything they said from the glass they use to the soy candle, to the actual wick everything is sourced in america so that i really like is it's not made in blank <laughs> you know what i'm talking about right and we all end up buying those things because you can't help it sometimes but when you can find something that's made in america it's a really nice thing so there's a link in the description box i hope you'll go check them out really really pretty candles soft fragrance really love it nothing overwhelming and a natural scent my last pick is this beautiful book called The Complete Language of Flowers, an Illustrated History. It is like an encyclopedia and it is amazing. So it's a soft cover, which is very nice, and it covers, oh my goodness, just about every and any plant you can think of. It's got over 1,001 flower species. Besides this book being absolutely gorgeous and it has an index so you can, or your favorite gardener, can immediately go into the index and look up their favorite plants. Uh, the current price on Amazon as of this filming is $17.39. It's worth so much more. Each entry, besides having a beautiful vintage style graphic, each entry provides the flower's name, characteristics, historic meanings from mythology, medieval legends, folklore, and flower poetry. Anybody who's a gardener is going to appreciate this book. It is going to be perfect for those long winter nights when you can't really get outside and garden. It's a beautiful gift. So there you have it. These are my six gift picks. These are six gifts gardeners will love to receive. I hope you enjoyed this. Again, all the items are linked to in the description box below. Uh, I am an Amazon affiliate, so if you purchase anything through the links that are in the description box, I will make a tiny bit of money. I put all of that back into this channel, so I thank you in advance if you do decide to do that. In the meantime, if you like this video, please hit the like button and please subscribe, and I hope you have a really good holiday season despite everything that's going on in the world. Thanks for watching.